All right, we're comparing three bows. It's real windy out here, so I'm probably not going to do a lot of talking. But we're going to compare the full throttle to the Halon 5 and also compare it to the Omen Max. These two bows are considerably faster IBO-wise to the Halon, even though the Halon's quite fast too. So let's find out how real-world fast it is. Each of these bows are 29 inches by 70 pounds. Uh, both of these have a 5-inch brace height, but this is a, world of a, a lot easier to hold back. Uh, the valley is huge compared to this. This has essentially no valley, and I actually like the Omen Max's valley much more than the full throttle. We have three different arrows. We have a heavy arrow and a light arrow. Our light arrow is 380 grains, and our heavy arrow is 670 grains. Let's shoot them through. We've seen up to 331 feet per second with this arrow. I'm going to confirm it here on the video. It keeps you honest. But sometimes a little lying is good too. That's 330 right there. Let me shoot it one more time. Same 380 grain arrow. Three hundred thirty feet per second. I've seen three hundred arrow. Still aggressive, but once it dumps, it dumps, and I can easily get into my holding pattern. I got three hundred thirty feet per second again, so it's the same speed as the full throttle. Good. I like how it dumps comparatively to the Alista 329. Halon 5. Similar kind of pull. This dumps perfectly. Long valley. Easy to hold. Three twenty, so it's only ten feet per second slower. Do it again. Three twenty one. 677 or 670 grain arrow going through. Full throttles up first. Low valley as usual. 255. And now it's the Omen Max. The arrow went all the way through. So we had to go look for it. Full throttle is 255. Let's try the Omen Max. Two fifty-three, so only two feet per second difference. Two forty eight, so we got even closer together. This is a four hundred and sixty grain arrow. Uh, people wanted to see what it did through the halon, so I'm gonna go ahead and gonna add that. Two ninety five for the four hundred and sixty grain arrow. Three oh three, so they're still pretty darn close.
So you can see the Halon 5 did a respectable job in comparison to these other speed bows. I hope you enjoyed the videos and got something out of it. Have a good day.